you doing guys? Right then, okay. Um, right, this is uh, a first for me because I'm going to showcase some of my PS4 games collection. I haven't uh, bothered buying any more Xbox 360 games. Um, so I doubt I'll be doing another collection of that. Um, so, um, right, I'm gonna, what I'm gonna do is, um, link uh, the time if you want me to, if you want to go forward to my opinion on what other game, okay? So I'll link the time and the descriptions, uh, descriptions, uh, down below, okay? Right, first off is, um, Battlefield 4. I'm not really a big fan of these uh, war games. Um, as a matter of fact, I haven't got, I've never, never played a Call of Duty game in my life. And uh, my impression of this is it, it's a little bit like a Call of Duty, to be honest. Um, but it was. Uh, was a best-selling game uh, when I looked around in the game store um, got it when I first got the PS4 um, actually um, multiplayer is better than the campaign um, yeah um, yeah very good graphics really good um, if you've ever played me uh, I'm I'm pretty easy to beat in these things so yeah but the graphics are very good but but as I said before it's a little bit it's a little bit of a Call of Duty type game uh, and um, I don't really go for war games usually uh, I do go, although I do go for first person shooters really, yeah, and uh, horror survivals, um, so it's alright, it's, it's not bad, okay, this one, um, now you do need a Playstation camera to play this game actually, um, it's just as 2014. Um, if you live in a terraced house um, and you have the television on your wall, I advise you to close the curtains before before commencing playing a game because it because it involves you jumping up and down a lot. Um, Otherwise, if you don't, you're only go, going to get funny looks off of passers-by, passers um, wondering what the hell you are doing. But, yeah, um, it is a lot of fun to play. A lot of fun. Um, yeah. Also, if you're looking to lose weight, uh, it's, it's also a good way to do some exercise. Alright. Okay, uh, now the game that's been that's been topping the charts re recently, that has recently been released. Um, Watchdog, well, Watchdogs rather, exclusive uh, to this edition, to the PS4 edition. You uh, get 60 minutes of exclusive gameplay. Uh, I've not downloaded the, the additional footage yet, or, but um, I think the card is in here somewhere. But for my additional gameplay, it's here somewhere. Yeah, it is. Um, yeah, it's a good game. It's a little bit like uh, 
Grand Theft Auto uh, 4 and 5. Um, but in my honest opinion, it really isn't as good as the Grand Theft Auto 4 and 5. Um, but it's a good free world game. It's a good open world game. Um, it is very good, uh, really good. You can wander around uh, Chicago and stuff like that, but you have to get past uh, some very challenging campaigns first. Um, have to bypass the cops. Um, very good game about about uh, about some vigilante. Uh, he experienced a tragedy. He lost his. He lost um, his daughter in in a road accident recently. Um, yeah, um, yeah, but it's a very good game. Um, also, uh, you can go and by the touch of your phone in this game, you can. Uh, there are there's a few games within games. games uh, I've played one of them and, it, and they're a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to play, but however, my only niggle about this is um, that. Um, sorry if I'm stuttering. Um, that the driving, um, the controls get well, get pretty awkward. It, takes a lot of getting used to the controls. Uh, he, any car you nick or buy it is liable to get knocked about a little bit and also uh, you lose points if you um, if you run over a pedestrian um, or something like that. But yeah, very good game really good graphics they did a good job it's worth getting this game certainly worth the money and getting it uh, okay um the next one up here is uh wolfenstein or wolfenstein rather the new order um done by the same people that did the original first person shooter doom id Yeah, um, the, it's the sequel to uh, Wolfenstein. Um, um, so up here, round about World War, uh, World War Two. Um, you uh, go round, um, round. Uh, so far, it's about going round killing uh, Nazis and. Uh, but my but my niggle is um, the uh, pro it has quite a long prologue. Um, initially playing this, um, I did not know I was actually playing the prologue. I mean, it it is a it is very long the pro prologue. We, really too long for a game um, well so far um, after the prologue you wake up in the hospital and you're you're being chased about and being cornered by a load of Nazis um, yeah um, I've not read her back it's actually 1960s it's 1960, it's, sorry about that term. Well, it's actually set up in a parallel universe where the Nazis actually win World War Two. So sorry about that, but it is very good. It is a pretty good game. Um, quite mad, uh, lots, of, uh, lots of good shootouts in it. Um, and um, 
in it, Venati use um, a lot of uh, fantastic machinery, a lot of uh, unusual machinery, and like um, this, uh, one piece of machinery in it. Um, well, it's, it kind of has a Bioshock twist in it. Like there's a giant machine uh, which is like um, the Big Daddy and another giant machine that is um, a bit like um, a, a bit like um, the security bots from Bioshock. Well, quite a good game. Uh, that's another game that's topping the charts at the minute. Um, so I think that's about it uh, for now. Um, yeah, and I hope you enjoyed my first collection showcase of my PS4 games collection. But um, the games are pretty expensive, so um, if they're going, these uh, videos are going to be few and far between. But um, I hope you also check out my blog which I do every week. And also please feel free to check out my Twitch uh, channel. Um, I'll put a link uh, in, the, in the description columns below and, and uh, please also like me on Facebook again. The descriptions are the description. I mean, the link will be below uh, in the descriptions. Okay, that's about it. As always, I'll see you soon in another video. <laughs>